Hi and hello, let's play fans. It's your pal Berg787 back with a brand new episode of EU4 Common Sense going for the Prestigeon Achievement. And um, I'm still ill, but I'm a different kind of ill to what I was yesterday. Today is more of the coffee. Um, uh, not coffee as in drinking coffee, you know, coughing is what I meant. Like coughing up uh, green shit. Kind of like this green stuff, or this green stuff, if you will. Um, so, not in the best of shapes. Uh, I've taken a lot of cough medicine. And. Um, so there we go, to stop me from coughing. But I'll try, I'll persevere. I'll persevere, we're not fine. One thing that did dawn on me is actually time. Because I've never actually played a game till like the end date, what is it, 18, 12? I was thinking, yeah, i got plenty of time, plenty of time. But it's sort of like, oh, actually, we, we don't have plenty of time. We've got a little over 50 years, 53 years exact, um, to get to Constantinople and get it cored. So uh, these dicks need to stop dicking around with these dicks. And these dicks also need to stop dicking around with these dicks. And help me dick around with these dicks. A lot of dicking. Uh, and I need to stop dicking around with Tunis. Can I even get into Tunis? I can't even. Like, I declared this war and uh, all kinds of crap. And I can't. A lot of stuff happened at the end of the last episode. Anyway. Let me. Um, you won't give me access, will you? Alright. So what we need to do then is beg. Otherwise known as improve relations. Alright. Good times. And we'll keep an eye on this. Ah, there we go. That worked. That worked a lot better than I thought it would. Ooh! Check that out for an air. 636. That might be the best king I've had in, like, millions of years. Maybe not millions, but certainly uh, a long time. Hold on. Where, where's... No, that's Portugal. I suppose this guy ain't too bad, but he's nothing compared to Salomon Solomonid. He's awesome. Excellent. Uh, you know what else I might do? What's this? Naval race against the Ottomans. 117. What's uh, my navy at? 100. Oh, you know what? I'm like right there. All right, we'll build that. We'll, we'll just mass build them. One, two, three. Well, actually, well, I, I don't know why I always count. It's just... If it annoys you, it annoys me as well that I do it. But I just can't help it. Like one of those people who read out aloud. Like, obviously I read out stuff aloud in this, but that's a bit different. What I bet was like just people who generally read out loud. I don't do that. Um, who are you, pricks? All right, hello. Jen. Hello, Jen. Welcome. Meet me in, in Tor Yogurt. I know it's not Tor Yogurt, but you know what I mean. What? I thought we were going to meet there. You can't just change plans on me. Come in there and hopefully be. Yeah, I was just to say, I was a bit closer than what I thought it would be. That's it. Get lost. Do we have enough? I don't really want a looming disaster. There we go. Let's boost our. Uh, that's being cored. Alright. Oh, did we complete that? I was going to say it didn't come up. Oh, wow, loads of stuff's going on. Uh, uh, peace offer. I will. I will accept peace from you, but. I want to extort more from you. Not that you've got a lot to extort. I would have taken like stuff over here, but Portugal took it. Uh, what can I grab from you? A null treaty? You're actually allied with Portugal, so what? You're like a vassal of theirs now, or something like that. Um, give me war reparations. Send demand. Bitch slap. Uh, gain. Oh, that's quite nice. Hardy seaman. Okay. Return. Return home. Portugal, did you cancel that military access? Is that what that was? It was good, because I was going to cancel it anyway. So, no. In your face. Who cares? I think they're whites up there. Uh, who? Kiowa, Spanish, Louisiana. Alright, okay. I love it when I just get told, get notified about stuff that doesn't really matter. Okay, here are these ships. But I just selected my army. So here are these ships. Ships! Ships. Oh man, was that Super General? Probably. Super Generals, that's the problem with them. They just die. I might not have been Super General, because this guy's two stars over here. Might have just been some other crap general. Was it the crap general? No, I think it wasn't. What's this? Ship costs. Is that to build? Or just in general how much ships cost? Like, the upkeep. Probably to build. 
All right, what are you gonna do now? What are you gonna do now, Ottomans? I have a bigger navy than you. Just march that bad boy up right into the Aegean Sea. You know, what? I'm gonna take it on a little spin. Since we can't go to war yet because we need all our allies. I'm not making no mistakes here. Even though we are a little bit rushed on time, but this time round, we're plowing through to Constantinople. I might literally have to plow through to Constantinople. There might not actually be any other option. Because we're going to run out of time otherwise. Let's go and have a little spy. A little incursion. Excursion. You know what I mean. So what you got over here? Why can't I see your troops? What is this shit? I should be able to see. Where are all your troops hidden? Alright, so you've got 50,000 right there. Well, that's interesting. Because that means... Where technically is this? Is that technically here, right? So that's where I'd have to plot. Yeah. So if I leave my ships here, if I was to declare war, these 50,000 couldn't come over here, could they? They'd be stuck. Which is pretty sweet. Which is actually how I'd like it. So you guys just hang out there. Because I would like 50,000 of your troops to be stuck on, on this side of the... Uh, is that the Aegean Sea? What is this? No, this, the, the Sea of Marmar. What am I talking about, the Aegean Sea? The Aegean Sea is here. This is the Sea of Marmar. Of Marmite. You know what I mean. I like saying you know what I mean, because it kind of excuses me of any mistakes that I might make. So I'm like, nah, yeah, well, yeah, I know I said that, but, you know, I didn't mean that. What I actually meant was this. Which I still don't say what I actually meant. But anyway. Please stop fucking around. Just out of curiosity, if I was to declare war on, um, you know, I don't need to butter up Portugal anymore. Go away. If I was to declare war on you, just out of curiosity, Great Britain wouldn't jump in. Why is that? Because they're war exhaustion and debt. Um, it would be the end of the world if Great Britain didn't jump in, but it would be nice if they did jump in. It would be more important that Persia jump in, just because they keep Bukhara off my back and add me troops over here, and the Commonwealth can steam in from that way. Okay. So it's not a, a jumbo lot to do. We have a free advisor slot. Let's see if we can't get some sort of good... No, give me something better than this. I can't... I would take that, but I don't want to pay 37 ducats a month for that. Why can't I get, like, a level 2 guy? How much does it cost? Wow. Well, actually, that's not that bad in sense. Let's boot these guys out. Retire. Because that might increase the chance of me getting some, like, level 2 guy. Or at least a level 1 guy I, I, who gives me something decent. I don't care about my maintenance or my land force limit. Aha, fort defences. Don't care about that either. What? How much would it cost me to fire him? 600? Alright, we're not doing that. That seems rather expensive. There's like 60. Maybe because the guy had been there for ages. Well, like I said, as long as this 46,000 hangs out this side. They must have more though. Hold on, let me see if I can't see if they've got more troops elsewhere. I said they've got 46,000 this side as well. Oh, is that, oh, did they just move over here? What are they doing? Where are they going? Are they following my boats around? Oh, they might be going to crush these noble rebels. Are they allied with Ak? No, I don't think they are. No. So where are they going? Now, where the hell are they going? What are they doing? Are they literally going to crush them? That can't be right. But I don't like the fact that they're this side. Move back across. They're not at war. They are receiving trade power from Ak. Alright, new diplo idea. Overseas merchants, yep. I don't know what they do. What, they're just hanging out in case these guys like cross the border or something like that. And you seem to have mobilized. Who are you at war with? Bukhara. Alright, well that kind of... Wow. How many troops have you got over here now? Well, that's not too bad. What are you doing? You've come over here to shout obscenities at me. That's what it looks like. Um, I've got another merchant, so where should I put him? Not there. Aleppo. I've already got someone in Aleppo, haven't I? Yeah, he's collecting. Oh, the USA's here. I'll go and check that out in a second. Uh, Zanzibar. We've got someone there already as well. Uh, probably Goa and transfer. Wow, what a name's that? Quast. Do need to do that guy. Declaration of Independence. Yeah, I, I don't care really. Uh, <coughs> <coughs> oh, sorry. I knew it was going to come. All right, well, let's go and have a look at that. 
not in that map mode though. So where exactly is the United States? Or, or, or the, I've never seen them in the game, so I don't know what happens. Do they have to like? Are they all like rebels now or something like that? Is that what it is? No. Oh no! Here, wait a second. Here they are. I found them. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> That's what I think of you. That's quite funny. Literally Manhattan. Oh well. Let's zoom back. Oh, hold on. Are you not at war anymore? Okay, that's good. Now let's see what would happen. Oh, you're massing all your troops. Let me move these guys out. What the hell are you doing? Are you at war? Oh, you're at war. You're at Bosnia and Austria. Uh -huh. Okay, this is going to be awesome because now you're going to send all of your troops back over here and I'm just going to lock them all over there. Yes, now is the time. Now is the, not quite yet, but Great Britain, why won't you jump in? War exhaustion. <laughs> Alright, I can probably wait. Just keep moving all your troops over here. No, what? Regional nobles challenge Ethiopia. Local nobles are not satisfied with the granted privileges. They demand more rights and are willing to back up. What? Crush them! Um. Do I have anyone near Badera? Because I feel like it's probably over here somewhere. But you know what? Instead of like just randomly searching, let's go and have a look. Uh, B A R D. All right. Oh man, it's all the way down here. Is that everywhere or just that one province? All right, it's just one province. Which is a... No, wait, is that the same province? No. Oh, here it is. That's a nothing province. I don't care if I lose 50% tax modifier from there. I just can't be bothered to go and deal with it. There we go. It's one of those. All right, you can have what you wanted. So I can't be bothered to deal with it. Now, how quickly is your war exhaustion going to go down, Great Britain? Because it would be pretty swell if you wanted to get involved. Oh, what? Persia? All oh, right. Because Persia right, are in a war. All right, we'll wait it out. I don't want to make any crucial mistakes. We'll wait it out. Because this is the war. This is going to be the final war, I think. We've got a proper plow through. What am I actually going to declare war about as well? That's probably the key. Oh, not alliance actions declare. Take capital. Yes, that's what we will do. All right, Great Britain are almost ready to be involved. Although Persia are kind of going the other way. Maybe I can warn Bukhara them to stop their war. Stop doing what you're doing. I'm the big boy around here. I don't know why I said it so weirdly. Like, big boy. Um, no, it won't be covert. Dynastic. Influence. Enforce peace. No. No. Maybe I can do it with Persia. Persia, you dickweeds. Or is that who I clicked on? Is that who I was trying to enforce peace with? Well, I can't do it with them. You need to be able to declare war on the target. Oh, right, okay. Alright, fair enough. You got me there. Alright, listen. We'll have to do it without Persia then. Pause. Because I think we've got most of their troops are going to be over here somewhere. You'd think so, wouldn't you? It'd be rather disappointing if they weren't. Alright. They're already technically helping us anyway. And we're going to take Constantinople. Let's go! I really hope I've trapped all their armies on the other side of the fucking straits. Because that would be pretty sweet if I have. Because if they are on the other side of the straits, ha ha to you. Ha ha indeed. Hardy ha ha. How much money am I making? You know what? I'm just going to raise all of my forts. Ooh, did I just do that? No, I didn't. Because I didn't actually click on the... Ma'am! Stop! 
eating my sesame cake. All right, we can also, yeah, we'll do that. Hold on. This. Activate all forts. I don't want any messing around. No mistakes. We don't have enough troops, really. How much do we need? 30? All right, march yourselves down there. I don't see all of their army over there. Well, there is there is like a 50 stack pretty much over there. But I know they've got more. They've always got more. Stinking Ottomans. Always got more lying around somewhere. What's this crap? Lose. Ooh, uh, I can afford to lose the money. All right, you've got to take some sort of weird round away. Okay. I suppose. Why is the supply limit so high? Oh no, the supply limit's not that low. I don't like having my army so far apart, but I might not really have too much of a choice in that matter at the moment. They can't have like some sort of super army elsewhere, can they? That I'm not, like, not aware of in this area. You know what I should do as well? Probably upgrade my troops. That would probably be a good idea, wouldn't it? Uh, not the Royal Mortar these guys um good good job <laughs> how many ships have they got there not enough might just go and beat up those over there split me no actually you know what I don't care just leave it as it is <laughs> that's it you're not coming back over here stay in there Siege these forts, my friends. Uh, what's this jazz? We'll lose 10 prestige. Our truce with Tunis is ended. All right, okay. See, now, you dickweeds, right? You're, you're all fighting down here, right? Yeah, that's it. Go on, fight Great Britain. Don't come into Ethiopia. I do have 18,000 troops over here. Where'd that? All right, okay. Over here. I don't think you're really doing anything that interesting. Go over here. Siege out that. Uh, so we've taken that fort. Excellent. Let's move on to the next fort. And laugh at that 37,000. Look at us from across the straits going, Damn you! Like that. And I'm like, listen, my Arkadash. That means friend in Turkish, by the way. Um, um, yeah, so, yeah, fuck off is basically what I'm saying to them. Ooh, another idea. Ooh, loads of stuff happening. Oh, now she could join me, hey, Jazz. You siege out all of these little pointless bits and uh, we'll do the rest. I've got this on level 5 as well, right? Speed 5. Speed 5 war. And that's it. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to flee. So you just get crushed. And that's it. Siege out Constantinople and give it to me. <laughs> just hand it over, buddies. Uh, should I actually lay off on this? Because I might need like a load of Diplo power to um, make peace. So we'll, we'll leave off on that for the time being. So good having a powerful navy. Especially against the Ottomans, because then you just trap their troops on this side where Great Britain and uh, and um, and the Commonwealth can slaughter them. Wow, this place still hasn't fallen. Is it because of these boats over here? Is that literally it? Alright. That's like minus 70. That can't be right. Give me... These 22 should be fine. Go and pound them. Just have to keep an eye out in case there's some other sneaky ship somewhere. Oh wow, did they come out and engage us? Do they think they can take us like that? Alright, you know what? I'm just I'm a little bit scared now because they seem to think that they can do it. Oh no, it's because that felt right. Okay, sorry, that's me being silly. And they've ran away. It's because Constantinople fell, I understand. So we'll just slaughter them everywhere. Awesome. Why is this siege, like, just not going anywhere, though? How can it be minus 70? It's, like, worse than when it started, right? It just can't fall. Can't fall, won't fall. Alright, there's not enough of you over there. Well, that's not good. Oh. 
curb stomp these guys, please. That stinks that you don't have enough men to siege that out. <laughs> we'll have to go and march them over there, I suppose. Oh, there we go. At least that's ticking on a little bit. Give me that 22,000. We'll go and do that. Now, there's no way I can take all of that just yet. I need to get this war score up. But soon. <sighs> Sorry, I was going to taking a swig of drink. But yeah, we're not doing that either. As I said, Tank tells me we're going to need a lot of Diplo power here. Alright, I tell you what though, this 18,000, you can like do the job of curb stomping. <laughs> like just smashing all these little prickies. Oh, you know what, so can you. I don't know what you're doing there, just hanging out. Like a weirdo. Smash. Smash some more. Smash even more. Oh, you got to go these weird routes as well, which is kind of annoying. That's it, Commonwealth. Come join me. Welcome to the party, Richter. Internal conflicts in Ack. Couldn't care less. Where is this fort? Is this fort right here? That seems a bit silly. Alright, go to it then, I suppose. Loads of little silly forts, eh? What happened? Did, we, did I, one of our generals die? No, just telling us we can hire one and it's been shuffled around. Wow, look at Hejaz leading that army. With Humadiyah Ibrahim. He's a pretty decent general though. 2, 3, 4, 1. It's alright. Algiers? Oh, hello. Look at the Papal State, man. Papal State done good. They certainly uh, did good. We still don't have enough troops over here. Okay, I suppose we need 30, right? Is that what it is? I couldn't care less. That's a good answer. All right. I'm going to pause it here because I'm done for now. Uh, things are going good. Let's just see out of our argument's sake what we could take right now. We could just take Constantinople. But I kind of want a path to Constantinople, so let's see if we can make a path. Not quite, but we're almost there. And then I need to core it, and then we're done! So we should be too far away, but we'll, we'll keep this war going for a bit longer to get a bit more war score, so I've got a path through. Um, thanks for watching. Hopefully tomorrow I'll feel a little bit better. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.